Hey there Shuby Doodlers, how are you doing? Well today I am going to show you how to draw a volute crater, <laughs> which is a kind of Greek vase. So if you're doing a kind of Greek project, you can draw one of these and make it look really cool. So what you want to do is to draw this kind of, it's, um, mm, what would you call it, an oval, but then we want to make it slightly wider on the sides like that. So come adding a little bit around the sides there. And then we can ink all the way around, taking our time, going nicely around the corner. There we go, that's a bit wobbly there, isn't it? But that's art for you. Now, what we want to do is to go straight up there and straight up there and join the two bits across. Then we go out at an angle, out at an angle, and join the two bits at the top. If you really want, you can put a very fine little lip around there as well. And on the bottom, we are gonna do, it's like a sausage stuck on the bottom. And then we're gonna have two Lines going out, join them together, and make that into a little sausage at the bottom as well. When you are absolutely sure that the ink is dry, then you can erase those pencil lines. What we want to do is go right from the side. We want to go up, over the top, around, and curl in like that. On this side, we want to go up, and over the top and around and curl in like that. And then we'll come down there. Whoops, <laughs> somebody just started trying to Skype me. And I'm meant to be switched off. Um, right, and then we can do very, very fine line inside there like that. And another one coming all the way down like that. The dot, 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 all down the middle. Fine line down there like that fine line all the way up the inside like that dot 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 now here draw a line down and draw a line at an angle and then split down the middle of those two there like that and then draw extra little ones down there like that and then here we're going to draw these little kind of waves so we want to have all these kind of patterns on this vase. Now there, draw a line across, and here, draw a line down, and then this wants to be at more of an angle, and they need to be just more and more at an angle each time, like that. And then we can draw little ones in between. So this is giving lots and lots of nice pattern. Then we need to draw another line in between there. And come up here a little bit. Actually, let's draw a line across there. Another line across there. Two lines across there. And we're going to draw these kind of little flames or dragon's teeth or whatever they are hanging down there like that. Now we need some extra stuff. So we're going to draw Athena, which I haven't drawn, but maybe I'll do that next week. I'll show you how to draw Athena. And by the way, this drawing idea and lots and lots of others from Ancient Greece come from my book, How to Draw Ancient Greek Stuff, real easy. You can get it from Amazon and you'll find all the links down below. So we want to draw Athena. Her helmet is going to be like that. And then it goes forward a little bit, back a little bit and across. And we can put another line there. And then she's going to want like a plume on the top is going to be a kind of a snaky thing with little plumy bits in there. You could maybe add a bit of shading like that. And then draw one, two, three. That's going to be the fringe of her hair. Right? And then we're going to draw curl, curl, curl. So this is her hair. And another one. And little curls in there. Little curls. A few more curls. And then we're going to have a nose which comes in, down to the chin, across and down to the neck. And then all we need is an eye, it's very simple. And then we'll have an, an owl in there as well. The Greeks love their owls, don't they? So we'll have an owl for Athens, isn't it? Athens, Athena. So it's Athens, Athena's owl, isn't it? And here we're gonna have two little ellipsy things and these are kind of like little flower petals coming off there and then we'll maybe have 
have something just filling in that space there. And there you go, how to draw a Greek vase, a volute crater Greek vase. Thanks for watching and keep coming back to draw stuff real easy every week, Thursday, four o'clock for lots more drawings. Make sure you are subscribed. And in the meantime, keep watching, 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 practice, 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 drawing, drawing, drawing. <laughs> I'll see you next time. You take care now. Bye bye.